to the Halloween Cub Lab. And we are going to do a spook Who are you? Thank you. Happy helpers, Miss Frizzle today on the Halloween version of Tub Lab. You might mommy. We might even drink some spooky drinks. Hit it. Go ahead, Bench. Turn it off. Can yeah, I see? Mmm. Want to drink some? Yeah. Are you gonna? Oh, you're gonna glow from the inside out. Oh. How is it? <laughs> mm. I'm glowing. Are you glowing? Mommy's look. You're glowing. That's Mama. Like can I have the glow? The camera's not even. Hi guys, now just wait a second. All right, I'm I miss my students so much. I haven't been there since Monday. Monday? Yeah, Monday. And it's just been driving me crazy because and now I have to stay awesome. home with the Thank mad you. scientist. <laughs> yes, and he's really excited about Halloween. So this is what I was going to wear on Halloween. Hey, camera hog. Today we are going to talk about sublimation. Sublimation is one of my favorite words, and we're going to give you an example of what sublimation is. I really do miss you guys. Okay. Oh, so over here I have a fantastic example of something that is sublimated. Watch out! Oh no! Oh. This is. Dry ice. Now, oh, not with your bare hands. It's very, very cold and it will burn your hand if you touch it. Okay, so we just touch it with gloves on. We can't. Did you get some on your hand? Uh -uh. Oh, you thought you might though? So it's, it's just really just ice, but it's, it's not frozen water. It's frozen carbon dioxide. Mm, mm, mm. It's very hard, but it is now sublimating. It is turning from a solid into a vapor into a gas. Oh, look at that. Whoa, it almost looks like fog. Whoa. <laughs> we are making fog right here. But even through my, my gloves, oh, please. even through my gloves, it's really, really cold. Feels like December, no, January in Buffalo, New York. <sighs> Crazy stuff, this. All right, we're very dangerous though, so I'm putting it in the tub where you will not go. I will. Correct? All right. That, my friends, is a perfect example of sublimation. Went from a solid to a gas. I never knew wearing a wig was so warm. The next thing we're going to talk about, condensation. Now condensation, we'll see. This is a good example of condensation. We have something cold on the outside and the condensation is forming on the outside of this cup. Now this is just regular ice inside, nothing else. And, but it's been sitting here for about 15, 20 minutes and water is condensing. It's turning to liquid on the outside. Okay. And we can wipe that off. So condensation, we are turning from cold air. It's not coming from the ice, it's coming from the air. So it's air is turning to a liquid. That's condensation. The, the water vapor is condensing on the outside of the cup. Pretty cool. Can I touch it? You can touch it with the glove on. Do not pick it up. Very dangerous. I'm going to watch you just to make sure. Still very cool, isn't it? 
Okay. Still sublimating, isn't it? Okay, only with gloves, right? Mm -hmm. Good job. Okay, let's come over. Let's come over. <laughs> What's coming in? What's coming on Saturday? Halloween time. What are you gonna do for Halloween? Probably trick or treat. You're gonna trick or treat. Ah, trick or treat. I love it. Okay. Now the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna make something called oobleck. What's oobleck? I know you don't know what it is. That's why it's gonna be so cool. So I have some just regular old cornstarch. I'm gonna put it in this cup. Hi, can I see? Mm -hmm. So is it liquid or is it powder? Powder. That's a type of powder. To this powder, I'm going to add some water. We call this making a slurry. So in here, I have some, I don't want to spill it on my computer. I don't need anything else on my computer. Remembering the gallium disaster. Okay. We want to try to make it into something that's a little bit more thick than this. So I have a little bit of, a little bit more cornstarch. Oh, yikes. <laughs> We're gonna mix this up. We don't need any fancy dancy tools for this. Uh, mad scientist, come here, please. I need you to describe this. Okay. Okay, now, How can you can take your finger up. No, take your glove off for this. Is this is that milk? It does look like milk. In fact, that reminds me of a very cruel April Fool's joke my sister played on me once. Uh. It's not milk. So you're gonna put your finger in there. And how does it feel? Cold. Okay, touch the bottom of the cup. No, inside like this. Okay. What do you feel? Sticky. Kind of sticky in there, isn't it? Hmm, so if I go in. And it stir it up. Can nice. you stir your fingers? Try stirring your finger way down deep. Now stir it. Oh, tell the people what happened. Mm. What's happening? I'm turning into yogurt. <laughs> like yogurt. Oh no! I hope it's not turning into yogurt. <laughs> I'm gonna, hang on, I'm gonna add a little bit more cornstarch now. Mom, where did I wipe this off? On that towel. be enough, don't you think? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh well, yeah, we might have to wash that out in a little bit. Hang on, hang on. I bet if we added some of that, that glow-in-the-dark juice we were drinking, we could make glow-in-the-dark oobleck. I, I want to do it. You're gonna add a little bit of water? <laughs> okay. That's regular. Right. That's what we started with. That's regular water. Here, stir that up. What happened? Hard. It's way up. It's what? It's way up here. Now I'm going to add a little uh, bit more. Now I'm going to add more of this because I want it to really glow. Hang on, bitch. Wait, wait. Let's turn out the light and see if this oobleck glows in the true Halloween style. Ready? Yeah. <gasps> Whoops. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> okay, let's see if this thing glows. Oh, ooh, oh, ah, ooh. Oh, apparently my camera doesn't like the glow. Hang on, let's take this. It doesn't like me either. Here we go. I'm gonna break this black light over. Hang on, no, that's regular water. That will uh, reduce the glow. Bring my black light over. No, I don't want any more water because it'll reduce the glow. We're trying to increase the glow. Oh, oh, oh. It got it. <laughs> As you can tell, it does glow. Unfortunately, though, yeah, my camera's not really liking this. Not the right one. Uh, it's not doing anything. It is. Oh, you okay, hang on. Hang on. Okay. Put the light back on. Light hang back on. on. Light. Lights, camera, action. Come on, can do it. There. Oh, there we go. Okay. <laughs> So, this oobleck glows. Can I do it? Oh, it's way up. Yeah? You want to taste it? 
What? It's, it's just cornstarch and water. Mm. You taste it. Cornstarch is not my thing. But, but as you can tell, ugh, it is now solid right under the top. Uh -huh. uh, here, wait, hang on, hang on. I'm going to pour the excess water off. And give me your hand, Bench. What? Come here, give me your hand. You're, this is just, we're going to we're gonna let you feel this. No, it's just going to be goopy. It's like, It's okay, but oh, 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 see, it's, remember when we were talking about solids? This is a non-Newtonian fluid, and it has characteristics of solids and liquids. I can't put in that. No, that's my condensation cup. But there's your oobleck for you. If I turn it on, do you think we'll trick the light for a second and we'll see it glow? Mm -hmm. Oh, dear. Ah, just for a second, it glowed. Now we see that it's slowly turning into a liquid. But I want to put it in there. Put it back in here. That's where it goes. All right, folks. This just about does it for I'm gonna wipe it episode three of Tub Lab Halloween style. You gonna dance? We need, we need the monster mash. The monster oh, mash. I can get it. No, it's not on anymore. That was just on the radio earlier, but now it's done. So, Bench, time to dance. Ready? <laughs> here, here, hold my hand. We'll dance to the monster. The monster. The monster. Happy Halloween, guys. We miss you.